Hi everybody, it's Lady Dre 1977 and I am back with another video. The last time I did a video was in January, back in the winter, and a lot has transpired since then. And the topic I want to address today is, do black lives matter? Really, that, that is my question. Not only do they matter, but when do they matter? Do they matter when someone dies? Is that the only time that black lives matter is when there's a violent death? And I have my own opinions about that. I will not discuss that in this video. I will just say, be careful of what you're watching and what you believe that comes out um, in the media. But when do black lives matter? Like I said, does black lives matter only when a black man dies? And this is not to go against black men. I don't have a problem with black men. I have a problem with how things seem to be presented to the world, actually. Do black lives matter only when black men die? Because what I'm seeing is the world is in a frenzy when it's black men dying. Do black lives matter only when people die? Do black lives not matter when you have women of other races in Hollywood who wear black women like costumes, but you don't want to go through the things that black women go through? But nobody wants to call, oh, black lives matter. And black lives matter, it matters for the entire black race, not just for men. Okay. Secondly, do black lives matter when you have these black celebrities? Every time you turn around, you see a black celebrity being accused. Oh, by the way, who raises their hands? Because my belief is they raise their hands or mostly they're told to do what they have to do because the people who own them are telling them to do it who raise their hands to do whatever act they need to do, i.e. molesting women or children, pedophilia, beating wives or girlfriends. And the whole object is not just to make that particular celebrity look bad, but the whole object is to make the black community look bad. Remember the video that I did probably last year sometime about black men, <coughs> excuse me, and molestation. Because that's really how I'm seeing this. But it seems like you know, black lives don't matter then. Remember the situation with the black people, I believe it was at Disney World, and they were fighting, looking foolish. That, that was another time when it was to be that, hmm, you see how these black people act? You see how ghetto they are? How unruly they are? They don't care, they don't give a crap about people that seems to be what the media is putting out there. Oh, let's talk about world star hip hop. Had all kinds of black folks on there acting a the fool. I mean, wow. I don't really remember seeing anything specifically to other races and there could have been on there uh, fighting and acting like they didn't have good sense. But who was the most on there? Black people. It's like, come on. Nobody was raising their hand. I'm not going to say nobody, but it seems to me the general public was not raising their hands, raising their fists to say, oh, Black Lives Matter, Black Lives Matter. Why do we continue to only think that Black Lives Matter at someone's death? That is not fair. Our lives matter when we're alive too and how we're being presented to the world. Now, I will give big ups to people who know that black people are not what uh, the media says that we are. Black Lives Matter to me is very hypocritical. I don't stand behind it. 
And I will sit here and I will say that all lives matter. You don't have to like my opinion. That is fine. But that is what I think. I am so sick of this narrative, this racial narrative to have black people and white people pitted against each other every time you turn around. It is tiring. It is a big lie. And in the times that we are in right now, I say it is time to focus on Jesus who died on Calvary's cross. It is time to make a decision to either walk with the Lord or to go down with the devil. It's your choice. This is a spiritual battle. This is not a physical battle. My suggestion is you choose between the two. You can think that this is a physical battle all you want to, but it's not. It's a battle against your soul. And you need to start focusing on the spiritual realm and get your mind off of this physical realm because one day all of this is going to be gone. Which one do you choose? To go with the lambs with Jesus Christ or to go with the goats? The choice is yours.